I found that the traditional layout, which um, almost all other upright vacuum cleaners adopt, very difficult to use in confined spaces, and also quite annoying when you come up against an obstacle. It's very difficult to manipulate the machine around obstacles such as chairs and table legs. And it often meant you missed areas, and it took a lot longer to vacuum the house. I felt there was a genuine need to produce an up, uh, a very manoeuvrable, full-sized, upright product for some time, um, from the problems I described earlier. And um, after a couple of attempts with different rigs, and um, after some discussions with Peter Gamak and James Dyson, I invented the first prototype, and that's this one here, which is a very simple rig. Probably knocked up in about 20 minutes, um, but does, it demonstrates the principle of having the single wheel mounted to the cyclone assembly. This, this rig came next. We wanted to put the motor inside. From this rig, we developed a, a full working prototype, and that had a cyclone pack, motor inside, suction, and a motorized brush bar. We wheeled that around, got quite excited, and then from there, we just sat down and thought, yeah, we really want to do this. How can we make the machine as light as possible? How can we get it into a vacuum cleaner? What about the stand mechanism? All those other things which we had to tackle. So the whole cyclone assembly and handle can pivot. Use this vacuum cleaner completely differently to a traditional vacuum cleaner because you, you're twisting the handle now, which allows you to steer the vacuum cleaner in a new direction. 